channel my name is Shamika if you are new and today I'm gonna be doing a DIY something I haven't done in a really long time on my channel um I wanted to do a DIY because I really like how the little safety pin tank tops be looking so I figured I should go ahead and hop on the bandwagon so I went and ordered me a tank top from Amazon it's it's a midi tank top it's real I don't know if you guys can tell and um yeah so like the racing back, I think that's what they call it. So yeah, it fits really good. I ordered a small, it fits perfect. Like it's not too tight and it's not too loose, but I'm gonna try to make it a little bit tighter when I um, do it with the safety pins. Just so that like, I feel like if I just cut it and put the safety pins, my boobs might fall out. So I'm gonna have to tighten it up a little bit. So yeah. So what you need is obviously a tank top. I've seen a lot of people just going to Walmart or whatever and ordering like young boys um white beaters like a pack of those that would definitely work that's the cheapest way to do it this shirt was like ten dollars those are probably like five for ten so that's a cheaper alternative um i just wanted orange specifically because i have some orange heels and then i have some shoes gym shoes with a little orange in them so i wanted to do an orange one so i can go with some of my other stuff I have a lot of white shirts. And so you just need the tank top and then some safety pins. I got these off of Amazon as well. I got 150. They all are two inches. I didn't get the multi-size ones. So I'm interested to see how it's going to work out with them all being um, the same size. So we'll see. I'm about to just go ahead and get started. If you want to see what I come up with, keep on watching. Hey guys, so I started out by making a little mark with some eyeliner on where I wanted to start the cut from. I did that when it was on my body. And then I just went through and just kind of cut it in like a swerve. I did the best I could. I was really nervous about this part because I feel like if you mess up the cut, you mess up the whole shirt. But I did it the best that I could. So you just want to go ahead and make sure you cut your swerve. swerve I went in and cut a half an inch more off of the sides just because that's what makes the tank top tighter that's what makes the safety pin pull together more so if you had the less fabric you have the more cleavage you'll have because the shirt is being like stretched so I went in and cut a half an inch more on one side and I'm not sure if I cut a half an inch more on the other side. I think I just cut a half inch on that one side and then I'm going to take my safety pins and go in. Oh no, I did cut a half an inch on each side. Okay, so I cut a half an inch more on each side and then I'm going to take my safety pins and start pinning it together.
this is what it's looking like now i like it but i wanted to like show a little bit more boo so i'm gonna go in and cut right down here i cut a little bit more open over here and then i'm gonna try it back on for y'all but i'm not gonna do that on camera because yeah and i'm also gonna add a safety pin right here so in total, it should be like 20, 22 safety pins that I use, 21, 22. So I might add one or two more. I keep looking this way because I'm looking in the mirror at it. It's really cute though, I really do like it, but it's, it needs to be a little bit of my old. Cleavage showing, boobage showing. I ain't really giving a girl as much. So I'm gonna go through, I'm only gonna cut this side because if I cut this side, my nipple gonna be out. So I'm gonna go through on this side and just literally cut behind these safety pins. So like another half inch. So I'll show you guys what it looks like. All right guys, so this is what it's looking like after I cut out like another half inch. And in my opinion, it's pretty much, it's pretty much looking the same. Like, I think I need to cut some more. I think I need to go in one last time. And this will probably give me some under boob. Right here. Right behind these safety pins. Like right here. Yeah, I'm going to go in one more time. Cause this, I mean, it's cute. This is cute. But it's not giving the girls. It's not doing it for the girls. So I'm going to go in one last time. I'm going to go in one last time. One more time for the team. And we'll see how it's looking. All right guys, so this is the final look. I'm going to leave it like this. Um, if I wasn't scared, I will cut it one more time through here. Cause then I know it would give me the under boob look. But the thing is I've already cut pretty much to the end of the shirt. So in order for me to do that, I will probably have to do a lot and then cut it on out or something like that. But I'm not about to do all that. I'm pretty satisfied with how it look. Um, and I'm noticing since it's a raker back, I'm getting some side boob action with the more I cut. Like I said, I could go back in and cut out some more of this if you want some under boob. That's what I would suggest you do. But I'm pretty much fine with how this looks. It's enough boobage for me, I think. I think I'm gonna leave it like this. I'm looking at it in the mirror. I think I'm gonna leave it like this. Cause you can, you can see some under boob. You just, it's just not super clear. 
y'all oh my god i do not want to go back in for a third time this is how much i cut this second time just cut this much more this is how much i cut the first time so i'm not trying to go back in if i go back in i'm gonna have to do a half for sure a half i ain't gonna be able to go in for real yes yeah, so let me just leave it like this i'm not gonna go back in so this is the final product i really like how it looks um like i said if you want more boobage you can go ahead and um cut more but i'm done cutting i don't want to cut too much and fuck it all up so this is what it looks like and i think because i have a racer back i have um more side boobage but to me it's cute and it's and it's presentable at the same time like i can wear this around people and i don't look too um, revealing so i'm gonna keep this one like this and if i do another one i'm slicing i'm cutting from i'm gonna do one from the middle and go over and then i'm gonna do one from right here so it'll be a big gap and then that'll help with the boobish that i was going for so i hope you guys liked the video i hope this was helpful a really quick diy for you guys it's trending right now so if you do it tag me your pictures on instagram and i'll see you on my next video don't forget to subscribe we in quarantine you ain't doing nothing else you might as well watch me so stop what you're doing and subscribe see you guys later bye